Hey guys, so I am back with another video and in today's video it's going to be my, I consider it a ginormous back to school haul. This is where I'm going to be showing you guys even my books that I'm going to be using for my classes. If you don't know, I am studying to get a marketing degree. Um, I will graduate in, I think like the spring of 2016, so I'm like halfway there this is my last year so I'm super excited about that so we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into this and if you guys have any questions or whatever you always know to put them down below if you are in school let me know and tell me what you guys like or dislike about school or if this is your last semester or last um semester if this is your last well yeah last semester or just um this is your end of the yeah let's get right into it the bag that all of my books came into and i'm sorry for all of the rattling excuse me um first let me show you guys i guess all of the pencils i picked out i am a big hold on whoa anyways i am a big pencil and pen like lover when it comes to school i like to have various options and um, different kinds of choices when it comes to writing because that helps me to like keep my work nice and neat and just have fun while learning you know even even at the beginning of the school year it gets it's fun because it's like oh new year meet new people blah 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 but then like towards the middle of the school year it's like uh please hurry up and be over with already but anyway, so um, I have pencils. The three that I have right here are the Icy Pencils, and they're by Pentel. And you guys know Pentel is like a very popular um, pen and pencil um, manufacturer. And this is these are the pencils I got. These take a .7 lead. And if you guys see like orange stuff under my nails, excuse it because I just finished eating cheese doodles. But anyway, so I got those, and then I got this Try Erase um, eraser, and you just pump it like that, and then the eraser comes out. I have one that I used last semester, but I used it so much, I feel like it's, like, going away really fast. And I didn't see, like, where they sell refillable um, erasers, so I just bought another one. Each of these items costs, like, a dollar, not, yeah, like, a dollar ninety, a dollar nine, or something like that. So I got these, and then I got some refillable erasers for these pencils right here and I got some refillable lead as well for the pencils too because I don't think I feel like I have that but who knows I probably I probably do but I wanted to go ahead and make this video so that I can like get my stuff together because I start school Monday yeah the 24th okay so anyway now to my books um, again, I'm taking marketing, so this is one of the books I'll need. It's a promo book, and hopefully this class will be fun. I am taking one online class, which I hate taking online classes. I just, I don't know, I rather, I'm more of a visual learner, not like, I can't, you cannot read me something and expect me to do it. I need like a visual or some kind of, of examples, or I'm gonna be, yeah, I just spat everywhere. But anyway, this is one of the books right here. Um, next book, I think this is for my writing class, which I'm most excited about that class because this semester I'm taking all, um, marketing related classes and this one is the only one that is not and it's a writing class, which I really like writing classes. So this is the book and if you guys know anything about college books and getting your money back, please before, if it has wrapper on it, please make sure you need the book before you open the wrapper because once the wrapper is broken, you cannot return these books. So regardless if they were used or not, you cannot return them at all. And the next book is this retail book right here. I looked through it a little bit and it looked like, maybe not, well, maybe, yes. It looked as though it involved a little bit of math. I actually like math. Uh, counting, I took this summer and I just, I passed it with a B and I was like super shocked that I even got that. So, but I really like math. I got an A in um, business math during the spring semester. So I love math. Um, next is this, I guess I'm taking like an advanced Excel and Word um, course and you get two books, the 
Word and the Excel book is right here. So I have to take that. And the last book I have is Economy or Economics. Maybe Economics. Yeah. Survey of Economics. That's the class that I shall be taking for this book. So we shall see how that goes as well. But anyway, so that uh, that's all of the books that I got. Now on to like the actual supplies. Um, so the majority of this, guys, is since you're when you're in college, you only need like pen and pencil, um, some kind of book, whatever. Like it's not like a big deal. Like in high, uh, high school, middle school, elementary, where you need color pencils, markers, blah blah blah, all the you know. So um, I have a lot of pens and pencils to show you guys. But anyway. So the first thing I want to show you guys is this um, USB car charger. Um, I think these are really essential for going back to school because if you have a car, especially, and you're in between classes, like I know I have some classes that are um, maybe like an hour apart and I need to charge my phone and I want to go to the privacy of my car, you definitely want one of these. And I love the two-prong ones um, because you can charge two things at once. This particular one is from Ilago, and I'll have the link to their website down below. But um, this is the one that I have, and my boyfriend tried it out once, and he absolutely loves it. So I know that it's going to be um, a great one and that it will do its job. So you definitely need some kind of charger, and I carry extra chargers and everything in my backpack when I go to school. So I always have like some kind of adapter, chargers, and everything in my book bag so that you know I won't be without them um next are notebooks and these aren't any kind of like special notebooks I did think they were cute the font that's on the front of them um these were like by four um for like three bucks or two dollars or something something crazy but it was um a pretty de decent uh deal and in the front of them they have coupons if you shop at Target because this is where I got them from, Target. So if you have coupons, um, if you shop at Target, they do have coupons. So, yeah. But I got four of these and they are by Mead. And I also got a 125 pack of reinforced paper. I love the reinforced paper because I'm very rough on my stuff. And... I hate having like the little hole protectors on mine like when I rip something. So I just get the reinforced paper and I don't have a problem whatsoever with the paper ripping out of my binder. Um, these actually came from the Dollar Tree if you guys remember the haul that I posted. Yeah. Um, I got some of these Wilson Jones um, Life Touch binders which if you don't know Wilson Jones they sell those at Walmart. Um, I think maybe they run maybe like four or five bucks maybe but um these are really cool they have like the little um i don't know what you call this but you pull it down first and it doesn't open but then you press it and it opens so i really like those so i can't wait to use these so i got um four of them in various sizes i got a one inch and a two inch yeah so i have four all together but I got those, so I only had to spend four bucks for binders, guys. These were at the Dollar Tree. And last, on to the other things. I just stuck everything in this bag right here to make it easier for me to pull it out. First thing I got, and I think is essential to high school, I mean, well, high school too, and for college mainly because when you get your notes and everything, your teacher does not punch holes in it for you like you get like in high school or middle school. You have to find a way to punch holes in it yourself and that just aggravated me really bad so i ended up getting this hole punch right here which wasn't a lot it was the target brand so you know you get a good deal on it um i got these westcott six pencil grip erasers i love pencil grips my favorite ones are the ones that look like yeah look like a piece of gum that's like and they're like this small you guys probably know what i'm talking about but i've been on the hunt for those for those and i have not seen any yet but instead i got these for now i got this little mini water cake um tin set it's a painting set if you guys don't know i have been getting into drawing lately so i'm super excited about that but actually i for really for real i got this for my boyfriend because he's more experience than i so yeah um if you guys were wondering this is the she love hair i just flat ironed it um it looks a little bend 
bent and out of shape because I've been wearing it all day. But yeah, just in case you guys were wondering. Um, next, I got these big marker pens, also for drawing and for writing in class. These paper mate um, pens, you guys know these. I love these. I absolutely love these. I oh gosh, I love these. I love 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 these. And these are the limited edition tropical um, pens here. I got the Bic Crystal Extra Bold pens. I love these because they have like a ball shaped at the end, so I like the way it writes and it's very they glide and they're really smooth. So I love these. And I know I'm 23, but who does not love glitter pens or gel pens? Excuse me. But this one has eight neon, eight metallic, and eight glitter um, variety within the pack. So, yeah. And speaking of the Paper Mate pens, I got the bigger pack, which these are actually pretty high. These are like $11 a pack, but I love these. These are the ones that like teachers and stuff use, but... I don't care. I really like them. So, um, this is the medium tip, just in case you guys were wondering. But they're like a felt pen. But they write really smooth and really good. So, I absolutely love those. And apparently, I got another pack of reinforced paper. Didn't even realize it. Um, I got three folders. This one says blah, 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 blah. And I just like to put, like, extra papers that I may get throughout the year that just have no place to go I got this one and these were a dollar a piece at Target I do remember that and then this one here hopefully you can see that so yeah I got those yeah as everything comes tumbling off my bed yeah okay I also got a pack of these index cards it's a hundred and it's the um four by six inch cards I kind of like these better because my hands are big so gives me more room to work with but I got these from Dollar Tree actually so yeah uh also got I don't know I've been really into erasers I don't know why like uh, yeah I don't know why so anyway I got these from Five Below they were only a dollar and they're rainbow erasers and I just thought they looked so cute and cool and fun so yeah <clears throat> <laughs> as I get something stuck in my throat <laughs> but anyway I really love these the color uh, anyway so hopefully they do their job so I'm excited about those I also bought this one from Walmart this is a Pentel um twist and erase pencil which looks like that and I got this one before I got the first ones I showed you guys because I had never got financial aid before so I didn't know you could buy like school supplies in the um building with it so like I bought some of my pencils from there because that's where I got the first one that I really like so yeah I really love those pencils they last long and the lead is really really tough okay and if you guys don't know by now you've seen these in several hauls these are the um Promark fashion sticks and I love these because they have like a grip on the bottom I mean on the yeah on the bottom and it's easy to write with and easy to work with and they glide really well and I love these so I have like five packs of those and I have another pack of index cards um some post-it notes that I actually got from Dollar Tree and I got some of these um binder rings which look like this and these are great for if you want to punch holes in your note cards and I know I am a sucker for note cards. I love note cards because they I found myself that they help me learn better. So I love these because, well, I don't know if I love them yet, but I feel like I'm going to love them because um, they'll help keep all my cards together. Because I don't know how many times during biology last semester I lost all of my cards or I couldn't keep up with some of them. So, yeah. And I got this fabric document holder, which is explains why it's so big. But I got this specifically to put all of my pens and pencils in here so that I, I may carry them away with me in my backpack to school so that I have enough room for all of them to fit. So, yeah, that shows you how bad I am. And I think there's a few um, pens and pencils in here. Oh, these right here. These are the big pencils. 
and uh, this is nothing really this is like stuff from last semester but yeah so these are this is the old one I have the old Pentel writing utensils that I have also you guys my pencil and pen collection is crazy not really crazy I have like a little trash can that you get from five below that you can stump on and open I put all my pens and pencils in there I thought that was like a really neat and cool idea so yeah but yeah big pencil pouch guys we're almost done I also bought these permanent markers I bought these for a DIY project that I've seen on Pinterest um the whole um get the shoe and do like the whole tie-dye effect on it with the alcohol and everything so I got these um these also came from Dollar Tree they are the Bic um retractable pens pretty much and they have the ballpoint so I'm excited to use those I uh, also bought this eraser because I have a dry erase board that I write notes to myself on all of the time. So I actually really need those. And two more of these pens, of course. And I needed to get this video out of the way because my school supply um, corner of my room became like really overcrowded. And I needed to like, yeah. But anyway, so next is the highlighters, some highlighters. I have the standard pack of Sharpie highlighters. I like the big fat kind because again I have fat hands so I like to you know yeah but anyway and the last thing I have I've shown you before I think I showed you in a um Dollar Tree haul this is just some um correction fluid as my sister likes to call it and um yeah oh that isn't the last thing I do have one more thing guys I think yes I have one more thing which I thought this was so cool my sister got me hip to it I think I want another one but they probably won't have them after yeah school has already started here so they might not have them anymore but it's this thing right here it's a um desk bin and you can put stuff in it and this is where I keep my chalk markers at and my um dry erase markers for my dry erase board and yeah so I really like this this was only a dollar at Walmart so yeah but that is all you guys so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys want any other kind of back to school or college type of videos please let me know down below send me your requests down there and let me know what you guys want to see from me because I'm kind of running out of ideas here so yeah help me out guys so until next time thank you guys for watching bye I don't know what I just did, but bye. <laughs>